Alright, so I said we'd try this again for episode 4. Now that I really understand what's happening here, we're gonna start in the middle, hit those two things, kill the towers. We want the towers alive, because they help us kill these fucking things. We should be okay. All the green ones. And as soon as they're done spawning, kill these fucking things. That'd be a hard freaking number to hit. We do need 90 though? Come on! Okay, see why I don't play first person shooters now? Wow! I thought we had this! What happened? significantly better but nowhere near where we wanted to be that's okay let's go to the next world we'll come back to that one that's a good call if I do say so myself all right where do we go next sundown path I think this is the one we were avoiding earlier if I remember right Really like the Couples used to walk the sundown path. Kid ain't here for pleasure, though. gets to the core before the kid. What? The floor starts giving way under the lightest step. The Doesn't single panic squirt that. could bring the whole place down. Fragments of the old world rain from the sky. I knew this place was bad news. Well, the path ain't exactly open to visitors no more. Security's all fired up. Oh, come on. See, the path was intended for leisurely strolling and such. The sky bridges link the path together. Ooh. One of their bridges whips the kid along. Okay. I really want that. Whatever it is. Finds a spyglass. Like the ones they'd use to search the stars. Air travel always was an iffy proposition. Now just take all those things. But calamity oh. changed everything, even where the wind blows. Holy shit! Nice. Let's 
guy's fun. Well, if we mastered the winds in the old days, we could do it again. But the question is, who else could have taken the core? What are they doing with this? My question. Well, holy no shit! I stole the thing. Oh, this is just annoying as hell. this through. Come on, hit him. Live munitions down the path. Hand grenade. Oh yeah. He's wires to toss those things plenty far away. That's what I'd like to see. Even gas fellas need some shut eye from time to time. They get real cranky when you wake them up. Boom. In all this toil, the kid keeps coming back to an overwhelming question. Why? Who else could have survived the calamity? Or that. That's also a good question. I'll give him that. So he didn't find the core that time. But that ain't about to stop us. Yeah, it still pisses me off. We could always see the stars. We just never could reach them, no matter how high we built. I like that zoomed out here. Wow. Try this proving ground. See if we can do this one. I got a good feeling about it. No place better than Trapper Shingle for learning to tread light and shoot straight. What? Trappers had to tread real carefully, or else take a nasty fall. They train themselves by clearing out the targets while not clearing out the floor. Any good trapper knows never to take a step till the time is right. Okay. This one's not too bad. Okay, now it's getting bad. So you're not trying to destroy all of them. A decent trapper wouldn't walk away if they had it. I'll go again. To think a rickety place like the shingle survived, and so little else did. Be 
got this. We got this. Kid decides to keep working his aim and footwork on the shingle. We think top prize is 60. Can we zoom out? No. Best time to pick a new spot was when swapping magazines. Damn it! Well, we didn't fall that time, so we got that going for us. Let's come back to it. We got ten minutes here. Hope you guys are enjoying this. I'm, I'm having a lot of fun. I really am. I hope I'm not being too quiet. Let's see. I want to knock this level out. They'll really like this one. Good. The dead welcome him with open arms. <laughs> the calamity took everybody after all. Kid sees it plain, frozen faces all around. He don't much care to see him. Not like this. This got dark real quick, then. Real dark. These folks never saw the calamity coming, but someone did. Someone close. Someone who ain't like Mr. Bentley and his kindly wife. It was someone like him. Kid sees him there gate in the flesh. It's a snag or two trying to get to him. Holy shit! He ain't about to stop, no matter what. I was expecting the flamethrowers. Those hit hard. He's got so many questions after all. Just ain't got time for answers. The Thunder Brothers didn't make it. Oh shit! They never saw what it was like beyond the walls. I love this backstory that's happening right now. Nor did the bird boy. Didn't make it. Or the birds. The Jawsons. They didn't make it. Brady Sr. Brady Jr. They didn't make it. But him, 
He survived. Ow! Ow! Kid finds proof enough that man ain't from around here. Asian influence that's happening right Just now. think, without that man, we wouldn't be here right now, would we? This is sharp as hell. survives as well. Kid does what he has to do. What do you say to a man who's seen too much? Kid hasn't a clue, but he says this. We have to go. Please. That's what I would have done. Ooh. He better have a lot of good shit to say. I am... Increasingly He's a curious. proper gentleman, that man. His name is Zolf. This no hiding, normal. he's an Ura. Folks like him ain't never been a common sight in Ceylandia. This is great. He's relieved to see a living face or two. The kid and I introduce ourselves in kind. Both to him and to each other for the first time. So I really like that we're not strangers anymore. What's he gotta say, Rux? We fought the Ura decades ago, but that was then. Things are different between us now. Zolf, huh? For Zolf, Ceylandia was like a second home. His real word about his first home, too. Far to the east. Zolf offers to help me plot the skyways for the kid. At least the calamity hasn't touched the stars, he says. He was born in the Tazzle Terminals. The Ura sent him on a mission of peace to our city, and he's lived here ever since. Hell of a peacekeeping mission. The Corps, they remember. That's why this place is coming together. That's why things are gonna be all right. There's a little more than just three of us in the future. Well, look what we have here. Hmm. That's from the facility that holds the stores of variety of Plans for a section that chronicles past and future efforts. Memorial? I think that's really cool. Necessary testament for the Yeah, let's build a memorial. The memorial. Here, yeah, kid can pay respect to the old world and earn it in kind. Oh, nice. The valediction. Just another one of my sketches. Nothing more. Wow. Defeat the number of required different beasts. I like this. This was a good call. Gonna give us a lot of Words can't express what happened. We got a couple of minutes got. left. Let's see if we can do any upgrades. Wider attack spread or more damage? Well, we have faster reloads. So that ought to make those out. fangs sink in nice and deep. Wow. Textile damage over time. A little Zolwood oil and that blade shines like a light. So we'll do that one plus the bow, which does damage over time? That's insane. What else do we got here? I like that. Oh. Can't be too careful these days. 
Okay, any potions? No, why are we still level 3? Okay, wait, let's go back. What do we have so far that we can use here? Health, spray, fragrance, carry on. And we have dead realm at the moment. Hmm. I think these are actually probably our best shots. For the time being. Alright, let's wrap this one up. What happened? Oh.